Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Well, today I'm going to be talking about what's going into my warming basket. And instead of this being a weekly warming basket, this warming basket is probably going to last me about two weeks. So these are just picks that I'm going to be using. I'm actually going to be spending some time with my family and I'm just going to be taking probably a small warmer with me, one of those little mini nightlight warmers. And so I even then won't I don't know. I might take a full size warmer. I might, I might take a full size warmer. But I'm only going to be changing out wax in just one room. So I won't be able to go through as much. But I'm still going to be selecting from these picks. And um, yeah. So then probably on the 17th of May, I'll, you'll be seeing me again pulling another basket. And then, as I've said in prior, in the last video, once I get enough empties, together then I will share what I've warmed but here we go are you ready okay so um I'm gonna put in and I just put this in a little bag because it wasn't closed all the way because there was so much wax in it it's from Waxidents and it's called Circus Dinosaur Cookies I have started to work on that one and it is really good um I really enjoyed that one and these are her big old jumbo clams. They're like, I think eight ounces of wax. They're huge. So anyway, and it, it was a dinosaur. And Amanda Netcoven is the owner of Waxidents and her theme is dinosaurs, if you're not aware. And so, yeah, it was a T-Rex and I took care of his head. But yeah, I'm gonna be working on this one. Oh, this smells so good. There's a lot of cherry in this one. I, I like this. So anyway, I'm going to be taking that or working on that one. And then, let's see, I have some Sensationals wax. I pulled Ice Cream Shop. I don't have the scent notes on this, but when I get ready to do a review, I'll have all of that ready. It needs to be used up. Yeah, so I'm going to work on that one. That's kind of a sweet candy type fragrance. And then I'm returning from last time is Icelandic Nights or Icelandic Lights, I guess you could say. And so I'll be working on that one. That's kind of a masculine scent. And then this was one that was also in another basket that I pulled, but I didn't even start on it yet. And it is Sugared Lavender Twist. And I do have the scent notes on the back. It is... Raspberries, orange, red fig, pink, sugar, vanilla, orchid, lavender, and amber. It's really faded. So, yeah. <laughs> it's kind of getting a weird color. So, I'm going to be taking that one. So, that's all of the Sensationals and Better Homes and Gardens. From Pumpkin Parcel, I have Elsa. And I just have a few cubes, le a few cubes left. It's kind of crumbly. That's... It's a soy wax. It just kind of fell apart a little bit, but it still smells amazing. Yeah. Oh, this is beautiful. It is lily and white rose. I get a lot of lily out of this, so that's why I like it. So, yeah. Really, really good. Definitely a repurchase for me, but yeah. So I just have a couple cubes there. And then from a crafty barista, I have tea and cakes. And there's no scent notes on this one. But, yeah, it's just pretty much a very good tea and cakes, tea and cakes vibe. So, yep. So, let's see. Is it upside down? It's upside down. Here we go. <laughs> so, I'm going to work on that one. And then from Goose Creek, I have peanut butter and jelly. I thought the grandkids would get a kick out of this one. Peanut butter and jelly, you know. So, yeah, I'm going to... Definitely work on that one when I'm in Wyoming. All right. And then we have some Scentsy. So I like to pick a seasonal one because, like I said in my last video, I'm trying to get through some of my seasonal wax. And I just have a few cubes left of Silver Bells. And I love Silver Bells. I could warm Silver Bells year-round. This is possibly my favorite mint scent that Scentsy makes. Seriously, it's, it's beautiful. And to me, I don't get like a Christmas vibe out of this. It's just a really pretty, beautiful minty scent. It's um, caramel and vanilla sugar. 
and minty candy. So there is that one. So I'm going to work on that one. That's a 2019 bar. And then returning from last time, and I have one lowly little cube left. I did work on it of a root beer barrel. So yeah, I'm going to work on that one. And then this one was gifted to me by Miss Cindy. And she did a wax swap with Michael Coltman. I think that's how this got to be in my possession. It came from the UK. It had actually an original seal on it. And I pulled the seal off. I don't have the scent notes to this one, but I will find those out when I do a worm review. And it is called Laffa Palooza. So I am excited to give this one a try. To me, it's kind of a fruity, fresh, floral scent, which is totally me. Yeah, there's almost like a hint of citrus in here. I'm not sure, but I really, really like this. It'll be interesting to see what the actual scent notes are, but, and I love the color of it. So kind of bright, sunny yellow. So that's Lapa Palooza. All right, and then returning, the, this was in my basket, but I never warmed it, and it's Melon Apple Granita. You guys, this smells amazing. It's crisp apple, sweet melon, and sparkling citrus. It's a 2018 clam. Oh, you guys, I could just do this all day. It just smells so good. It's just, mm, it is so good. You get that citrus, that fruitiness. It's just and it's not really heavy on the melon. I don't think there's there's a lot of melon, which is good. I don't like heavy melon scents. So, yeah, that one is Melon Apple Granita. And then, because spring is here, spring is here in Idaho, we have lilacs and violets. I don't know what happened to that label, but it's lilacs and violets. Oh, man. This is a 2019 bar. So... I need to warm this one. It, ugh, it smells so good. Just reminds me of springtime here in Idaho. And then I have cashmere. And I like this one. I think this one was gifted to me by Miss Cindy as well. I love cashmere. I don't have the scent notes. But it's just a beautiful, beautiful scent. It's a great bathroom scent. It just reminds me of my favorite body wash. There is one... Um, by dial but it's called magnolia blossom but it's this smells really good you guys i'm i'm loving this one so yep yeah, definitely gonna work on that one and then last but not least we have luscious lemon this is an older bring back my bar i love it it's just a creamy wonderful lemon scent i love this scent very very good it's a very very bright citrus. It's almost like freshly squeezed um, lemon juice. Oh man. And then there's that sweetness. There's that creamy sweetness, almost like a creamy uh, lemon pudding. Almost. It's just, it's good. It's really good. I like this one. So you guys, that's what I'm going to be warming. So that is it. <laughs> that's all I got to say. Hey, you guys take care and have a great day.